Okay. So. The Swan King, Ludwig II of Bavaria, Christopher McIntosh, and I got some ink on the cover for some reason. Um, so, this is a um, newer edition, uh, 2012 edition of it was originally um, published in 1982, and it was redone a few times, but this is the newest version of it, and um, one of the things he is famous for is, well, it, it's the back of the castle, but um, this castle in Neuschwestein. Um, if you see the front, you can see three um, of the, the Disney castles um, portrayed from this one castle. Um, the Disney logo, Sleeping Beauty and Cinderella's Castle. Castle. Um, I don't know what I said. But um, anyway, um, yeah. So um, his fairy tale castle um, inspired, um, three Disney ones, so, that's cool, and, um, he's, and he was nicknamed, um, the Swan King, the Mad King, but, um, he really did try, um, like, he loved Wagner, and he loved building, like, the cast, um, his, this, not only this castle, but um, Lindelhof and Hiren Chemise. I think that's how you say it. But yeah. Um, so he just added to um, the epilogue of um, what has happened between when he wrote this and today. And um, he adjusted a few things that. Um, he wanted to, but he still stood, he is still standing from when he wrote this. Um, it's in certain sack, like, um, the captive years from Cage to the Throne, um, Sophie, Wagner, um, the Crucial Decade, um, Farewell to Wagner, the Twilight Years, um, the Trap Closes, so, um, it's in segments of his life or um, certain people or events in his life and um, when I did my project on him for a high school project a few years ago I used um, uh, the older version of um, the older edition of this because well um, it's been a few years out of high school well um, in the project so, and I liked this book and still do, and I find it very informative and like you got um, a few pictures in the middle, you got quotes, um, and like he does, um, there's like, um, like two pages of references, and um, he does, it's, um, three, this one is 307 books, like, the size of this one, so, like, this, uh, um, this version of it, it's 307 pages, plus the bibliography is, um, and other stuff in it, but, so, a king, a European king, um, so, to me, I like this, if you want to go into the more eccentric, um, personalized, because he, at the time, people thought he was mad, because, um, of today, 
um, cause today we wouldn't think of it as say insane, but they did, and they also um, Darman um, tried to push him, push the insane thing, cause like um, he didn't want to do what um, the uh, government officials wanted to. So, but like he could have been um, like really having a mesh eh, mental illness or it could have just been his personality that he didn't um, want to do the government political military side of being a king um, and he w was really loved by the people so and um, he got a, um, the author has a doctorate in history um, as a writer, he has specialized in the history of ideas, Central European history, and Western Ecotistic tradition. So, um, I haven't really looked him up, so, but, I like it. So, the Swan King. <laughs>